Hey, it's Jen from the Brassy Broadcasting Company with a quick tutorial on how to improve the sound quality of your Zoom recordings using Audacity. And I know a lot of podcasters out there love to use Zoom as a way to record guest interviews because it's pretty easy for both parties to connect to and use. Unfortunately, the quality of the audio isn't always the best. So what I'm going to share with you is certainly not the only way to do things. It's just a few tweaks that I use that I've found helpful to improve audio quality using Audacity. The first thing that I do is normalize the track. So we're just going to click over here to highlight all of that. We're going to go to Effect and we're going to go to Normalize. And you'll see on the screen what happens when we hit Normalize. We're going to leave that at minus three and hit OK. What it does, it kind of levels out the volume a little bit. That's what the normalization. That is what the normalization will do. Hey, this is Jen, and I wanted to do a test record. It still sounds a little thin, so the next thing that I like to do is add compression. So again, we've got the full track highlighted. We're going to go up to Effect and go down to Compressor and open that up. And right now, it's set at minus 9 dB for the threshold. That's a great place to start. And I've got a very fast attack time set. And that what that is, that attack time is when the compressor starts to kick in. So the way this kind of works is as soon as the volume hits minus 9 at this meter up here, then that's when that compressor kicks in to kind of squash that back down and level out your sound a little bit. And so we're going to hit OK and see what happens. Let's go back and play that. Hey, this is Jen. And I wanted to do a test recording in Zoom because I know a Okay, so it's a little bit thicker now, so not quite as thin, but it still sounds very harsh to me. And what we can do is go in and fix that with equalization. So again, we go into effect and we're gonna go to equalization. And what I start with is go to curves. I'm going to take out some of that treble. So we're going to start with treble cut. Now, as you can see, it takes a lot of this high end out. So let's preview what this sounds like. Hey, this is Jen, and I wanted to do a... I'd like to get a little more of that out. It still sounds a little thin to me, a little harsh. So we're going to pull some more of that out. And what I like to do when I am adjusting settings in EQ is start by removing what is annoying to you. So rather than start by boosting bass, I'm starting by removing some of those higher trebly frequencies. And we're going to actually go down here and take some more of that out. And let's see what that sounds like now. Hey, this is Jen, and I wanted to do a... Okay, so that is getting better. Now, I want to boost the bass, and I'm going to start there at about the 100 mark. And just start boosting that up a little bit. So we'll go to about 5 or 6 dB. Let's just see if it sounds any warmer. I also want to boost that mid-range at 500. There, let's try that and see what this sounds like. Hey, this is Jen, and I wanted to do a... Okay, so that sounds better than what it was, so we're going to hit OK. And let's play it back now. Hey, this is Jen. And I wanted to do a test recording in Zoom because I know a lot of you like to record. Let's see. Let's just tweak that mid-range just a little bit. Pull some of that out and see what happens.
Hey, this is Jen, and I wanted to do a- Oh no, I think we need that in there. I like, I like having that preview button. Let's boost that back up a little bit. Hey, this is Jen, and I wanted to do a- Okay, we'll go with that. And then the last thing that I'm going to do to help control some of those high peaks is go into effect and I'm going to set a limit. And what that limiter does is it tells me, it tells Audacity not to let the audio go past a certain peak up here. So I'm going to hard limit that. So as soon as it gets to minus three, which is going to be right here, it's going to shut it down and not let the volume go past that. So we're gonna hit okay. Let's give that a listen now. Like to record podcast interviews in Zoom. Unfortunately, it's not always the best quality because you might be loud. Okay, and as you can see, it's not going past that minus three mark up there on the level. So those are a few things that you can do to hopefully improve your sound and audacity. What you're going to have to do is import your, your file from Zoom and then play around with it. Play around with the EQ and the compression and season it to taste. For more podcasting tutorial videos, you can go to Jen Eads Brassy and subscribe to my podcasting tutorial playlist on YouTube or visit BrassyBroad.com. See ya!